To write the formula for lead 4 fluoride, we look up lead on the periodic table, and that's Pb. Then fluoride, we're looking for fluorine, that's F. So lead, that's a metal. It's a transition metal because we have these Roman numerals here. Fluoride, or fluorine, this is a nonmetal. So when you have a metal and a nonmetal, you have an ionic compound. And you need to think about the charges on the lead and then on the fluorine here. Lead, it tells us right here, this 4, that means lead has an ionic charge of 4 plus. This is a transition metal, and that's what the 4 means. Fluorine on the periodic table is 1 minus. So since this is a neutral compound here, these should add up to 0, which they don't right now. We can change the subscripts right here to make that happen, and we can use something called the crisscross method. We move the 1 down here, and then the 4, we move that down here. We don't write the 1 by convention, and we can get rid of some of this stuff. And that's the formula for lead 4 fluoride, PBF4. Let's check our work, make sure we got that right. We said lead, transition metal, they told us the charge. That's 4 plus. And fluorine, we can find that from the periodic table. That's 1 minus. So I have 4 Fs, 4 times the 1 minus. That's 4 minus. 1 Pb, 1 times the 4 plus, 4 plus. So these add up to 0. They give us a net charge of 0. We're done. This is the correct formula for lead 4 fluoride. Let's clean it up one last time. And that's it. Lead 4 fluoride, PbF4. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.